In this quick video, I'll show you how to evaluate and sketch a piecewise function pertaining to tax. This is part three of the series. The question reads, in a certain country, income tax is assessed as follows. There is no tax on income to 15,000. Income over 15,000 and up to 30,000 is taxed at 12%. And income over 30,000 is taxed at 18%. We have to A, write a piecewise function of the above information and sketch its graph and B, determine how much tax is to be paid on an income of 17,000. We will represent the amount of tax you need to pay as f at x. And we're going to introduce this curly bracket where you pay zero tax when x is less than or equal to 15,000. And you pay 12% tax, and we don't want to use percent, so we're going to divide this by 100. 0 0.12 when x is between 15,000 and 30,000. And given that this is a continuous function, and given that this is less than or equal to 15, you don't have to add the equal sign right here. And finally, you pay 18% when you make 30,000 or more. So when x is greater than 30,000, you will pay 18%. So now that we have our piecewise function, we have to sketch its graph. Let's do that. So I've set up my x and y graph. This will represent my y, and this will represent my x. But instead of y, I'll use f at x. And this right here will represent my x, which is the amount that you make. And given that our x's range from 0 to 30,000. I'll use intervals of 15,000 to mark down my x. And for my f at x, I will use intervals leading up to 0 0.18. Now, what we will do is graph this first part. And they say that if you make less than 15,000, so from here all the way to here, you pay nothing. So we're going to use this highlighter here just to show that it ranges from 0 to 15. And since it is equal to 15, we will put a solid dot right there. And we're told that you will pay 12% between 15,000 less than x. And we're going to denote that with a hollow circle. And x must be greater or equal to 30,000. So 0 0.12 right here will be represented by a hollow circle. And this will extend all the way to 30,000. We're going to put a solid circle at 30,000. And finally, anything more than 30,000 will be at 18%. So we're going to put a hollow circle once again. And anything greater than 30,000 will be at 18%. And there you have it. That graph right there represents the relationship between the amount of tax you pay and how much you earn. Let's move on to part B. Part B asks, determine how much tax is to be paid on an income of $17,000. Now, before we jump into answering this, recall the question tells us that income over $15,000 and up is taxed, but any income that you earn from zero to 15 is not. This means that only $2,000 of this $17,000 will be taxed because only $2,000, $17,000 minus $15,000, is over fifteen. So let's show that $17,000 minus $15,000, that gives us a total of $2,000. And only $2,000 is going to be taxed at this rate. So we're going to take $2,000 and multiply it by 0 0.2, and this gives us a total of $240. Not too bad. So there you have it. That is how to use piecewise functions to calculate tax. If you found this tutorial helpful, please support our channel by subscribing or by liking this video. If you have any further questions, you may visit our website at studyforce.com. We are an online service for students seeking free homework help. See you soon.